Hi everybody, this is CVGS, I'm Zakapti here, and on this recap for the Vanguard livestream for Overdress on the 6th of April 2021, we'll be looking at the reveals and sharing our collective thoughts on them. We're inching closer to the first booster set release, and while most of the cards in that set has been revealed through the live streams and the card of the days, uh, we are missing a couple of key boosts here at the moment. One of which is the poster unit himself, Virena Valiant. From the commercial that they aired during the first episode of Vanga Overdress, Varina Valiant is a grade 3 that seemed to hit that he has an Overdress ability. And on this week's livestream, its skill was revealed despite it being unannounced. Which is great! It's not like I want to take a break on these recap videos or nothing. It's not like I have a whole bunch of videos that I have to edit. Now we also got Varina arcs during the livestream. And even though it was already revealed as a card of the day, we will go through its skill for the benefit of those who are unaware. Virena Arcs can overdress over Trickstar. To refresh, overdress is a state that the unit goes into when it is normal called over a specific unit on the regard circle, at which point the specific unit below is stacked underneath the card and becomes the original dress for the overdress unit. Virena Arcs' auto ability. When this unit is placed on the regard circle, if it is in overdress state by Color Blast 1, draw 2 cards, and this unit gets plus 5k until the end of the turn. Varina Arcs adds a great alternative to the original Varina in the start deck. A Color Blast 1 draw 2 is an invaluable skill, even if you are playing it in premium. Varina Arcs is a great early to mid game unit to play down in Overdress for that 2 draws. Some might feel that Sunburst Evolution puts a limit on the Overdress deck as it can only fetch the original Varina. But once you see what Varina Valiant can do, something start to click in place. Speaking of Varina Valiant, its skill is that it can Overdress over Trickstar or a grade 3 or lower unit in overdress state. Its continuous skill on a regard circle, this unit gets plus 5k for each of this unit's original dress. And the last skill is an auto skill on the regard circle as well. When this unit's attack hits while in overdress state, by color plus 1 and discarding a card from your hand, you stand this unit. An overlord by any other name would hurt just as much. We'll be transparent with you guys here, we had a prediction that Virena Valiant would be a great 3 unit that either had a Vanguard skill or something akin to a Vanguard-like skill in Overdress State. Something similar to like what Gunslot does in V-Series with the Blaster Blade in the Regard Circle and turning it into like a Vanguard Circle of sorts. Something along those lines. Our prediction was that it could do a Drive Check while in Overdress State, playing up to the idea to the Dragon Empire's Over Trigger ability. While what we got was less than what we predicted, it's still a great skill and adds a lot of on-hip pressure to the Overdress deck. Virena Valiant can easily Overdress onto Virena Arcs or Virena and replace their used Draw 2 or an expensive Soul Blast 2 Retire 1 skill for one that adds good on-hit threat by restanding itself when it hits. Last thing we'll touch up on is the announcements of the DSR in not only DBT01 but also DBT02. The Dress Secret Rares are the collectibles of already released cards like Trickstar and Nirvana. And while Nirvana got an alternative art for its design, Trickstar actually got illustrations from Clamp placed on the DSR. This makes Trickstar quite a collectible card and I predict that anybody who cracks this open will have a card that's potentially valued not only in the Vanguard world but also in the anime world. And the trend continues into the second booster set out in June in Japanese as Clamp's illustrations for Violence Bruce and Bastion are the DSRs in that set. Once again, they are highly collectible. But PSA you guys, please purchase responsibly. So what do you guys think? Is Virena Valiant too much of an overlord for you? Which side of Virena Valiant would you like to play at? Leave comments below. Anyone be part of the live conversation with us on Overdress, we're on Twitch for Tuesdays live streams and Wednesdays for our discussion streams on YouTube. So be sure to follow us on Twitch for our gaming live streams, slam that like and subscribe button and ring the ding the bell so you can get notified of all of our videos whenever they release be for Vanguard or for Battle Spirits. Be sure to follow us on all of our socials, we're on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram, we also have a Discord as well so you can find myself, Leon and Dempster there on most nights. If you like what we do here and want to support us directly, you can join our membership where you can be like one Howl Lord, Dengri and Gieto, and Samuel McKay and have access to our meme emotes and badges during our premieres and live streams. So with that said, thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next video. Bye bye!